All right, Pete, hey, I love you. Love you. Good luck. Good morning, 4.40, and I, I'm feeling great. Man, I should wake up this morning, or this, this early every morning. Don't you think? Yeah, no, yeah, no. All right, so today's a big day. Peyton is having her surgery. So we are uh, just getting a few things ready, and we're gonna go wake her up and head out right now. You ready? I think we're good. I hold. Um, crate full of goodies, and uh, I think we're all set. Well, good news is you're gonna go to sleep. Yeah. Okay, so for it's saying entrance is closed, use emergency entrance. This is the entrance she told me to use. You ready? Yeah. Good morning. You can bring it's your stuffed even animal. Morning. Oh, it's way like it's the crack of dawn. Very, very crack. Yes, this crack. Wait, are cold. Yeah, but it is chilly. It's chilly. We're here, Jordan Valley Medical Center, and the American flag and Utah flag. Are you ready? Yeah. You're about to cry. Mom's gonna cry. <laughs> <laughs> it sucks because Michelle can't come in with us. It's just gonna be Peyton and I. Yeah. Stupid COVID. <laughs> so I'm proud of you. And I love you so much. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Hey, look. Okay. She's gonna be strong. Me or Peyton? Both of you, actually. Alright, let's get your mask on. Alright, well, 6.01, they just walked through the door. <clears throat> I hate this, this is hard. I know there's been a lot of things that people have had to deal with. That Corona has put a crappy flare on. And this is definitely one of them. Whew. I'm gonna go over to my sister-in-law's and go crash on their couch for a little bit. <clears throat> Hopefully get some sleep, but be close by in case they need me. So. <sighs> Dang it. Yeah. Just got changed into a robe. Oh, All so right. Nice. You excited? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. 
I'm getting closer. I'm almost ready. Anesthesiologist is going to come talk to you. And that's for medicine to help you feel, not feel the hurt. And then Dr. Anderson will come in and talk to you as well. Okay? This is the nature of the beast. We've tried to warm it up as much as we could for you. We've got smiley faces. Those are the the feet right there. What do you think? Exciting. Yeah? Exciting? You go, don't know what this means, don't know what that means, don't know what that means, don't know. I know what that means. That means be happy. No. Yep. And he said that you you get out of chores for like at least a couple weeks. How pumped are you about that? Yeah, but you're going to have to do homework. I know. Yeah? Okay. Hey, hey, I love you. Good luck. All right, it's official. She just went back. I didn't even get like a good goodbye. Like I feel like so they just wheeled her away from me. So feeling a little, little emotional. But overall excited for her, I think. It's only gonna be an hour long, so that's nice. And then she'll have her recovery time and everything. So um, now we just wait. That's her right there. Anderson, patient ready for OR. Here we go. At the top. Anderson, procedure start. Praying for you, Pate. All right, so the doctor just came and let me know she's out. Everything went well, which was a big relief because it's actually been two hours now um, since they started. And it was kind of scaring both Michelle and I because it was only supposed to be an hour long. So um, I was starting to get wor worried. I was trying to stay strong for Michelle, like letting her know that, no, I'm not worried. It's fine. It's fine. Because uh, Michelle's not even here, right? So they only let us to have one one person here with us. So or with with Peyton. So I'm the one that's here, and I've just kind of been relaying information to Michelle and everything. And she's like, "Should we be worried?" And I'm like, "No," but really, I was worried inside. So sorry, Michelle. Um, anyway, but he came out and told me everything went well. Some of the X-rays. So they actually put a pin, so you can see that like this is her heel everything they put a pin in between her foot there which there's actually so there's a hole right there like there's no bone no anything it's like a perfect spot for this pin to go in which uh, will help it so her foot doesn't turn in i guess um and so that's the top view of her foot so i guess i should have said hey if anybody gets wheezy at this type of thing go look <laughs> But uh, anyway, so that's the pin. Crazy, right? That's crazy. So um, she's all done and uh, she's just coming out of it right now, out of uh, anesthesia. Um, and I should be able to see her here very, very soon. So can't wait. How are you doing? Good. Yeah? Feeling okay? Okay, so these are them. There's her boots and her feet. And look how nice these are. Compression ones and you can release it here and pump it up here. That's awesome. Look at those cute little toes. Looking good. We're calling mom. <gasps> look who's here. Guess what I got? This. <laughs> they gave her a Pepsi. Because <laughs> Peyton requested the cherry Pepsi. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I thought the same thing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We don't have root beer. We'll get her some water. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. So do you want to see my boots? Yeah. Can you flip it? Did you flip them? 
There you go. There's her boots. Wow. Cool boots, dude. Yeah. You can like a grass right say, here. You can say, killer boots, man. So um, do you remember yeah. anything? Do you yeah. remember going back? Yeah, only going back. Did they ask you to count backwards? No. No? They just yeah, gave yeah. you gas and yeah. you so just they, fell asleep? No, they put this like tooth thingy over me and uh -huh. like it smelled like strawberries and I was taking deep breath and then I was falling asleep. And then you don't remember anything else? Yeah. And then just woke up? And we were t in a different totally room. Yeah, a total different room? Oh man. Well, how are you feeling? Good. You feeling tired? Oh. No? Feeling all right? Yeah. You ready to go home? Yeah. Okay. Let's get you home as soon as you can. She's so cute. <laughs> yes, she is. She looks dang cute in this in this nightgown thing or this uh, medical gown. Do you want to take that home too? <laughs> yeah. All right. We won't have to take it home. Do you feel okay, sweetie? Yeah. Yeah. Do you feel like any pain? No. Nope, she's good. You're doing a good job. Yep. Yeah. It's because she's so brave, so tough. Huh? Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, so Peyton is out of surgery and she wanted to show you something. I got Pepsi. She got cherry, wild yeah. cherry Pepsi. And she is pumped mm -hmm. out of her mind because she's never ever had caffeine before. <laughs> Um, and we're gonna limit that, or how much you drink with that. So, oh, yeah. all right. Might help you wake up a little bit. Look who it is! Oh my goodness! <laughs> darn, darn, darn COVID. Did you get Cooper in the wheelchair? Oh, yeah. The Mercedes Benz. This is the Mercedes Benz of wheelchairs. <laughs> it really is though. Look at that cute girl. All right, our little girl. She's all set. Let's go home. I'm so happy to be back with you. Are you doing okay? Yeah. You seem quiet. She's no. just go coming out. Just coming out. Just How normal. are you feeling? Good. You doing okay? Yeah, I'm just tired. Yeah, I bet. Well, we're gonna go home and hold you and watch movies with you and cuddle you and do all the things. We just stopped and got Peyton her first ever Jamba Juice. What do you think? Gum. So good, huh? Got her a white gummy. White gummy, white gummy. We also gave her a throw up sack. Do you have the throw up sack back there? I just there? gave it back to her. Okay. And we are gonna well, get her home. Um, just in case the medicine makes you a little nauseous. So, on our way home. It definitely could make you nauseous, so let's just be careful. We're home and Jabet came out to pay, play Peyton a little song. Hi, Hi buddy. How was your day? Good. Hi. She made it. She's safe. Hi, Pony. Oh, it's in a race I thought it was soap. Okay, <laughs> Peyton, you ready for this? How are we going to get her in? I'm going to have to carry Hi, her in. Big. Set up look at Palmer, look at her feet. She's like, uh. Better get used to this view. Daddy carrying, oh, should we open the door? Um, I got it. Apparently. <laughs> Apparently. Peyton, tell her again. Peyton, I'm matching. We're matching. <laughs> Oh, oh, that is so sweet. My heart could burst. I better get used to this. My girl's cuddling on the couch with her feet above her heart. So dad was there talking to the doctor. I don't know anything about these. 
Yeah. So, um, number one, they said to ice behind her legs, like behind her knees and everything, because there's ligaments. So they went and lengthened her calf, and these ligaments are going to be tight and inflamed and everything. So um, you're going to want to uh, ice behind ice back the, here. behind her legs. Does that sound right, Doctor Palmy? <laughs> and they said that we could put ice out over top because it will just help it keep it cool and stuff. So you don't unbuckle the boot, you put the ice the over them. We don't unbuckle them, we don't take them off or anything, and we just try to ice it. And yeah, like they don't come off. So Pete, I guess let us know when you gotta go potty. Okay. You still look a little bit pale. You doing okay? Yeah. We did wake up at four. Uh, okay, well, so your heart needs to be lower than your feet. So lay back, relax, and let me know if you need something. Mm -hmm. And here, pretty soon, we're all going to have nap time for the whole house. Better get used to that. Mm -hmm. Hey, you should take a nap. Oh, wait. How was your plus three hours? I've been such a deep sleep. I know, I left the room and like, cause I slept for about an hour. Yeah. I left the room and I was like, he looks so tired. Oh my gosh. Tired? You know like when your body feels really, really heavy? Yeah. I was in that state. That state, really I'm sure. Cool. What a long day. That was nice. And how's it going for you, little one? You doing good? Peyton, you are so blessed. You have a lot of good friends, yeah. huh? Right there alone, I can see like a, a bunch of things. A balloon in your face. Her friend Abby just brought her this. Her friend Aubrey brought her this awesome package a couple days before her surgery. Mm -hmm. And my friend Julie, <laughs> she called me at the wrong time. <laughs> she called me the other day when I was so stressed or texted me and asked if she could bring dinner. And I was like, yes. <laughs> So she just oh, looked out so amazing. That looks so good. A white chicken lasagna, caramel brownies. Wow. That looks caramel. so good. Yeah. Caramel. Caramel, caramel. Seriously, we've had so many kind people. Thank you guys for all of your DMs and YouTube comments and comments on our posts. Like, I feel more loved in this moment than I have in a very long time. So thank you. We really do appreciate it. And I think she's doing okay. We are staying very much on top of her medicine. Yeah. Very much on top of it. Except that these are really heavy. They're very heavy. She's feeling the weight of the boots. Hopefully she'll get used to that. But she's doing okay. Yeah. Our day is almost over. It is eight o'clock. We have kept up on medicine. She's eaten. She's gotten, look how cute this is. She's gotten a bunch of sweet things from her friends. So many nice people. Are you ready to go to bed? Beckham's wow. teaching her about constellations. So cute. That is so cute. That is. We saw some like galaxies. Oh, look at that. That's where the black hole is. Oh my gosh. Oh, I love our children. I love. How excited he is. Look how excited he is. Like, they won. Day one is room. over, and Peyton's asleep oh, I look in her bed. Beautiful. We look, we look hot. Hello, everyone. Looking hot. Let's talk about, though, the stress relief that is off of me. Yeah. I will be 37 weeks in the morning, which means our baby would not be full term if it came. My mom is here, it which means- It would be full term now. It would be. He, he came, came in the middle of the night. We would have someone here for our kids. Yeah. And, best of all the game, Peyton lived through her surgery. She lived, guys, she's alive. And I, I will be there. That. Like, I just feel, well, I really do feel a big burden good. lifted. Good. So. That's good. Thank you guys for all the love and support too. Everybody's been so great. We have a great community so here. So awesome. You guys yeah. are awesome. So many prayers, yep. vibes, so good vibes, So many vibe, good love. comments and just thank support. You. So we thank you. Yes, and I've been reading all of them to her. And she's been like weirdly hyper all day. I guess <laughs> yeah. from all the attention. Yeah. Or maybe some kind of medicine. So hopefully tomorrow is just as good as today was, but we're not expecting it. <laughs> um, we'll, we'll just we'll just hope and pray for the best. We set our expectations low, yeah. and then we're happily surprised. Yeah. I talked to her about having a positive <laughs> attitude, 
towards this situation. So I hope that she can take a positive attitude because I think that that goes a long way. For sure. So, so we're going to bed. Thank you guys. We've been up since 4 a.m. Yep. It's 10. Even we're going though to I bed. didn't sleep for like three hours today mm -hmm. from like uh, four, three to six. So that was fun. But, and I, but I'm going to be able to go to bed just fine. Yes. So thanks for watching, oh. guys. We'll see you next time.